Hello everybody, welcome back to Arkeen to 74 presents Let's Play Mermaid Swamp. Well, welcome to Let's Play Mermaid Swamp. <laughs> this is a game created by the same guy who made Crooked Man, which I, yeah, anyway. <clears throat> this game contains grotesque and somewhat sexual images. Please be mindful of this as you play. The author takes no responsibility in advance for any trouble that or damage is indirectly brought about by the game. Well, that's comforting. <clears throat> Rin Yamazuki. What the? I think it's a girl. Am I underwater? What the hell am I doing? <laughs> what? Somebody there? I've never seen this game played. I only found it because I was looking for games. So, here we go. Yeah. Ren, wake up! Yeah. Uh, Satoru Wakasugi. Wakasugi. Stop sleeping already for crying out loud. He doesn't have glasses, but anyway. <clears throat> ah, shut up! I was just taking a nap. That's so bad. A oh, hell of a nap. Yuta's been Yuta Yuta been driving all this time and you just been snoozing in the back. She's not one hit of lady in this one. Not exactly interesting in being ladylike for an early balding punk like you. Well, who are you taking your oh no wait, he's driving. The the guy in front of the blonde is driving. Rising sign ran, I'm guessing yeah, it's Yuka Kinchi or Kikuchi. I'm going to guess you slept well, given you started around noon. Yeah, but thanks to Baldi here, more of a rude awakening. Quit your yammering, yammer, Yammerzaki. Yammer I know, these names, man. These names. Hey, Yuta, where are we going anyway? You said something about kitchen, kicking things into high gear, but are we going in the mountains or what? <laughs> My bad. Takahashi. I don't know where this is either. What? Huh? You telling me we're lost? Yep. I don't have the first clue where we are. That sounds like me. You gotta be kidding. You said the mountains were a shortcut. So I thought you knew the way. <laughs> Sorry about that. I mean, I did kind of know at first, but then the fog just got so thick. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't funny, shrimp face. <laughs> that ain't funny, shrimp face. This is exactly why I didn't want to go on no trip. In your lousy old GPS less car. Oh, don't kick the seat. Well, now what do we do? We can't even see any signs. What are you doing over there? That's just my daughter. Huh? You know, why did you stop? I didn't. It just stopped. Hold on, I'll try the engine. Yeah. Ah, crap. That thing is totally busted. Are you for real, dude? You deed. But. Ugh, wait here. I'll go out and take a look. Hey, we're in the game. Nothing looks wrong to me. Why the heck did it stop? Yeah. Is there somebody there? Yes. There's an old man. Look at him. Yeah, he's fat. Maybe it's... <laughs> he's a little chunky. Quite the su Oh, don't mess with that, Bubba. I need that. Quite the surprise! What would you like to be doing up in these mountains, miss? Ah. Sage, stop! Let's try to take my speaker. It's just an old coot. Darn it, don't freak me out. Hello. Daddy, I just say hi. It's a speaker, really? Anyway. Well, that's very unfortunate. Is there anywhere you can stay? Nah. Uh, take that over there, Bubba. I need you to take your picture upstairs. 
that one. Nah, if we just can't get it running, I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. You are needing to do that. My home is nearby. You can stay there. Even if it's summer, it's quite cold in the night. Huh? For real? Well, let me talk to my buds. That's a relief. Thanks, old man. But you're sure? We don't want to pressure you. Well, I'm a landlord around here, you see. My house is much bigger than mine is. I would appreciate some young folks making use of it. I'm really grateful. We'll get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. Oh, I can see it now. Whoa, this place is huge! Dang, now that's a mansion. I kind of feel bad, Gramps, but thanks. No. no. Thanks. Whoa, it's really roomy inside, too. You gotta be rich, am I right? <laughs> rich enough to be ashamed of the state of this old place, perhaps. Come along and I'll show you to your rooms. Okay, rule one of any watching really creepy pastas. Don't trust old men you find you meet randomly. <laughs> you can use this room, Miss Red. Forgive the old fashionedness. It ain't nothing. I kinda like the retro thing. Thanks again, Grabs. You're a little hard knocker, yo. I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner. Well, until then, make yourself at home. An electrical outlet. A fear, please. Ooh, bed. Mm, nice and comfy. Ooh, look. Chest! Chest for valuables, maybe. There's nothing inside. Nothing inside. Alright. Okay. okay, okay, we get it. I have a cell phone, a charger. And nothing else. Alright. Sitaru Wasagi. It ain't enough to old. It ain't that old of a building, really. You see that other place out back now? That's old. I didn't read all that. Huh? There's another mansion out back. The old man tells me he, they built this one a generation ago, since the other one was falling apart. Huh? Can I see it? Large swamp can be seen in front of. The, there's a swamp. Mermaid swamp. Here's the old man. We'll leave him alone for a minute. In the bathroom. There's more clothes. Ew, who's clothes? Oh, door. Toilet. I don't know what to expect. It's locked. I don't know what to expect of this game. Crooked Man was pretty creepy, though. I will admit. Uh, if you caught me before I deleted it, then you would know that it did freak... Same room. It did have its scary freaking moments. <clears throat> hey, Ren, you see that big swamp in front? Yeah, the one you can see out the windows? It's super huge, isn't it? Maybe I'll go... S you'll go swimming in a swamp. Really? That's smart. Gators? Oh, there we go. Okay, we're back. Something about geek and all, I don't know. Anyway. Nice! Your room has a dresser. I ain't got one of mine. Yes, you do. It's a great design, isn't it? You can come over to do your makeup in the morning. Oh, that's a dresser. Thanks a bunch. Because you know girls gotta do your make. What is this? this Old fashioned Japanese room. And you shouldn't walk around too much. Don't want Grimms to find me and get mad. 
Alright, well that is all the exploring I could probably do. Hmm, I don't have much food on hand for gas. Well, chicken and egg and um, rice be alright. But, I'd kind of prefer something beefier. Like, literally, beefier. Unfortunately, I'm out of beef. I must apologize. Oh well, I'll eat anything on this stomach. Or m maybe on most stomachs. <laughs> Alright! Wait, there's a door back here. Where's this one? Oh, that's the dining room. Okay, I must pass it. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Outside? Okay. Whoa, that is one big swamp! Hmm? It's got writing. A stone monument? Ah, a man did abduct from the seashore? Crap, I can't read this. Maybe Sitaro know about... Oh, Sitaro know about this old stuff. He's got more knowledge than he knows what to do with. Curious about the monument. Jeez, gal, man, you not, you gotta not do that. Oh, my apologies. Did you read the inscription? Nah, I couldn't make heads or, tail, heads or tails of it. What did it say? <clears throat> it's a legend that's told around here. It's the legend of the so-called Mermaid Swamp. Legend? It originated in the middle of the Majiri area. Era. My family was governed, had governed this area since around that time. What? That's a long time to be in one space, Pops. It is said that the sun had a late, of a leader ascended the mountains. Down to the seaside, I discovered a mermaid. Sounds shady right out of the gate. <laughs> well, it is a legend. The man was so smitten with the mermaid's beauty that he took her to the mountain home. He created a fifth tank for her to live in, and he filled it from water with this very or filled it with water from this very swamp. But a mermaid of the sea cares not for swamp water. The mermaid grew weak and became quite ugly. Her clear skin swelled, her scales fell off, her face was metallic and ringing bells, and was reduced to a beastly hole. The mermaid took on a most repulsive form, and subsequently died. I know mermaid's wrath is not a pretty thing. Young women have vanished from the nearby village. It's said to be the mermaid's curse. As such, this monument was put up to mourn her. What do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting nothing less, yes? Yeah, uh, sorry, I don't know about all that. <clears throat> Tell it to Sitaro. He likes stories and stuff. Oh, is that right? Well, I've prepared dinner now. You should come to the... Sage, stop, Bubba. This is not for playing with. It's a speaker. If you would. Oh, finally, let's get a move on. Oh, no, no walk it? Whatever. Mmm, delish. This is some great stuff, old man. I'm glad you like it. You can slow down a little, though. Oh, the bath is free if anyone wants to use it. You must be tired from the day's events. Please rest yourselves. Yuka, aren't you gonna eat? What's up? Yeah, I guess I'm too tired to have an appetite. Whoa, you okay? We'll clean up. You go get some rest. Yeah, that's what I'm making. Alright, thanks, Yuta. Mm, yummy, yummy. Y'all clean up now. What do we have to clean up after you? Do it yourself, yum. Yummy, yucky. <laughs> okay, childhood friend much? Yeah, work on your name while you're at it. Man, I'm stuffed. I'm really, I'm ready to conk out after that bath. Ah, uh, night the fluffy bed. Mm. 
Huh? Am I underwater again? It must be a dream. I mean, I'm not drowning. My eyes don't hurt. Can't move a muscle, though. There's the body again. Somebody's there again. Who the hell is it? Stop staring at me! I'll kill you! I'm gonna stab you! Yeah, I'll go get you! This guy, this ch chick ain't crazy at all. Got some good sleep. Morning already. I'm gonna kill you. Got some good sleep. Where are my colleagues? This is probably where it starts getting creepy. She's still in bed. It's morning, wake up. Sorry, Ren. I'm feeling kind of cold. Can you rest a little longer? All right, you going to be okay? Don't push yourself. Yeah, I'm fine. Maybe I caught a cold because of all that fog. Summer cold? <laughs> My son's playing with his dog. His, he's got like a toy dog that talks to him and knows his name and stuff. Where is everyone? Oh man, where is everyone? Not in the dining room. We'll check the kitchen last, because I have a feeling that's where people are. That's where I would be in the morning. <sighs> Still locked. Up there there. Dang, you guys are up early. What's the deal? Early? It's already 10. But anyway, I checked on the car and it's still not looking any better. Couldn't be out of gas. It's so old, I wouldn't roll it out just falling apart. But whatever it is, how are we going to leave? Oh, what's happening here? So, yeah, old man, sorry, but can we stay a while longer? Well, that's unfortunate. As a matter of fact, I have to go for the nearby village. Don't, ah, uh, you're buzzing at me. To attend a memorial service for the next few days. Is that right? Well, we'll be out of here soon then. We wouldn't want to stay too long. Even without a car, we should find our way walking. We could just leave the car and take the train home. No, it's quite all right for you to stay. <laughs> for you to stay. I'm the only one who lives here, after all. And I would quite appreciate someone looking after it. Huh? Really? Indeed. You would certainly not... You would certainly... And you wouldn't get far walking in the mountains. Certainly not in this fog. You're more than welcome to stay until your car is fixed. Just please don't do anything dangerous like walking around the mountains. Alright, thanks, Gramps. Well, I've got to be heading out. Keep an eye on any fires. And again, don't go walking in the mountains. Yeah. Yeah. We'll hold down the fort. Don't you worry. Don't go dying yourself, you hear? <laughs> I'll be careful. So long. Hey, it's evening already. Better get in the bath first. I hate going after the guys. Where is it? Uh, I think it's... Oh, no, it's, uh, it's this way. Sploosh. Oh yeah, that's the good stuff. Couldn't ma really manage to relax yesterday. Having this huge bath like this is sweet. Oh, Fuka's gonna bathe. Sucks that she's not feeling well. Kind of always up a trip. I'm getting sleepy. Hmm. What was that? Whoa! She's, uh, chesty. Gah. Yeah. Oh, what the heck is this? The water's all gross. It wasn't this color when I got in. And not my fault, right? I'm not that dirty. 
Hey, what's the matter? What? What the hell are you forging a really for? Oh, uh, okay. For real, though, this is so money. Just how gross are you? Shut your mouth. That ain't the problem. The water just got all muddy. Poof! Like that. Alright, jokes aside, then. Isn't this swamp water? Huh? Why would it be in the bath, genius? I don't know. Maybe the plumbing screwed up. Could have mixed some swamp water. Throw the shower and toilet up, okay? Well, no baths for a while, I guess. We'll have to hold out till the old man's back. I'm out. Darn it. What even? What even? Ah, this teased me off. I guess I'll check on Yuka and then get to bed. And with that, we will save. Because we've been playing this for 22 minutes now. Alright, everybody. I hope you've enjoyed this game. This is interesting. It's not as scary so far as Crooked Man. But it's definitely going to get interesting. I can tell. I'm hoping. If it doesn't, I'm going to be mad. Anyway. This has been part one. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and as always, boys will be boys, but real men, real men finish what they're doing. Bye-bye.